Hey y'all, this is going to be a quick one just to make sure you're not missing anything in Talk Off. The Halloween event is set to end this Sunday. If you're not planning on playing the event, then at least you can enjoy the few maps that are free of zombies at the moment like normal. The rest of the video is for those that want to either play in the event for the achievement or want to profit off it while we can still so listen up. Basically, Ultra Noiser Ammo is OP against zombies and I've been able to one tap to the head or two to the torso with it making cleaning out hordes so much easier than before. This follows into the second point, and that being what the final quests entail. Assuming you have played a lot of the event, then you should hopefully be on sample 4. If not, it's okay, but I will be covering sample 4 and beyond for the scope of this video. Labs, streets, and ground zero are going to be the last ones to be freed from the infection. Which is super since the quest after sample 4, Dark's Hour Before the Dawn, requires you to kill a heap of zombies on those three maps. That's why I made sure you all knew an easy way to kill them. After you complete this, you will hit a fork in the road. You can either side with therapists and use a lethal medicine to kill all the infected, thus freeing Parker, or you can side with Jaeger and find a way to cure everyone. However, that requires a little bit more work as you have to go to Shoreline, get their recipe from Santar's office, and then kill Santar himself. Only after doing that, you have craft a cure from the lethal medicine you get in the hideout and plant it all over like you would have done with therapists. Now, if that sounds like too much work, despite the awesome XP, loots, and achievements you get from doing it all, BSG is giving two daily quests for two maps before they are clear of zombies. These quests offer huge XP gains and some decent loot, but there is a secret. If you manage to kill at least one zombie as per the requirements of the quest, you still get the reward. However, you have to wait to the following day to get it. So if killing 40 zombies in woods at night is too much, then just kill one with a cheap gun and wait until you get your reward until the following day. That's it. Thanks for making it here. If you learned anything useful, I only ask if you could leave a like to help more people get this information.